big moment uh, for us uh, in Hawaii. The nomination of Oahu Circuit Judge Michael Wilson to the Hawaii Supreme Court is going to get another hearing this weekend as concerns over Wilson's professional conduct towards women is being called into question. The Hawaii State Bar Association has already given Wilson a rating of unqualified. Now the state Senate Women's Caucus is raising the issue. Big Island Senator Malama Solomon spoke on the floor of the Senate on Thursday. I, uh, you know, I didn't create the situation, Madam President. It is what it is. It is what it is. You know, females do feel intimidated. They do feel that they are not uh, treated as equals. If we were, Madam President, we'd have equal pay (laughs) for equal work. You know, that's the bottom line of this argument. So women have not been treated fairly in this society. It's unfortunate, but it is what it is. And this is why I want to thank my fellow uh, senators, part of the uh, Women's Caucus, for standing up and having the courage. It's not easy. The easy thing for us is just to turn the other cheek or, you know, make like it's not happening. But it's out there. The State Senate Judiciary and Labor Committee will take up the matter again this weekend. Senator Clayton He chairs the committee. Saturday at 11 a.m. This gives everybody the opportunity everybody, including Greg Markham, the president of the bar, to come forward with names and to come forward with people. Absent of that, it would be very difficult to, to, to change, in my opinion, the will of the committee at this time based on innuendo, allegations, insinuations, and rumor. I feel that those involved If they feel that there's going to be any kind of reprisal, then perhaps there could be another way of being able for these persons to come forward to be able to testify to the contrary. So these are my concerns.